Hey, you guys, come on in. See my garden. This is my house. This is really my private little spot in the middle of town. When I arrived, it was all completely open, and I put up the bamboo fence, and this is just my little secret spot. So come on in and check it out. Nick helped me make this pond, and uh, we actually have a frog that lives in here, and all the plants I've just put in over the months, finding them, and then I found a very good plant guy who actually shows up at my house and delivers them now, so I've gone a bit wacky with the plants, and hopefully when the rain comes, everything will get very big and very green, but as you can see, it's not big, but private here we got a little sitting area we have a little barbecue over here that we can make a fire in and it's just like the little area I can sit in and contemplate my navel in the middle of the day the chair over here is from Tracy and yeah this is where I like to hang out in the afternoon I moved here in October and basically this house and this garden have been my project ever since and when I'm not working or doing my photos or reading or walking around I just enjoy being home and being here. I'll show you some of the plants. This is a uh, bourgonvillea that I hope will grow up and completely cover this fence. I don't know what these flowers are but they're really beautiful when you see them up close. I got the fuchsias a couple of weeks ago. The water lilies in the pond I got from James. I basically copied the idea from him because he has the same thing at the Finca and I thought it was absolutely beautiful. The same with the Spanish moss over the windows. I took the vines off the fence and you see it's growing. I thought it would make it look like a very fairy tale house from the outside, but actually it's really beautiful at nighttime when you see it coming down. I think one of the favorite, one of my favorite things in this garden is just this tree that's above us, this ficus tree. They're terrible trees because the roots basically grab everything up as they search for water, but by having this tree here, it just provides a roof for my entire garden, which right shade wise and also when it rains we were it was pouring rain the other night and people were sitting here in the garden just because the tree formed such a roof yeah so this is my little garden this is my um, house of Klaus sign this is so everybody knows where they are welcome to the house of Klaus Just go take a peek inside. Come on!